Now we know how to hold with the left hand, it's time to place the right hand on the club. So we take our address position here, let the right hand hang down next to the club here. Like I said before, just let the hand turn in slightly. What we're looking to do here is to place the club in the first three fingers of the hand and then close the hand over the right. Now we know how to put the left hand on the club, it's time to place the right hand on the club. From our address position, we'll let the right hand hang down next to the golf club. We'll bring it forwards, we'll place the three fingers, first three fingers of the right hand underneath the club here, and then close the hand over the left thumb. I have no preference if you're looking to play interlock grip, or overlap grip, or even baseball grip. What I really want to see is hands close together. The right hand is turned in slightly over the left hand. You can't see the thumb. If you can see your thumb here between your hands, that's bad. Okay, what we're also looking to do is keep the thumb and forefinger close together. And they should be about the same length on the golf club here. We don't want the thumb to be long. We don't want the index finger to be long. We want them to be about the same length. So if you've got the feeling your hands are turned slightly together, that's great. That allows free swinging of the club, it allows a great rhythm to the swing, creates good club face control.